Hi, Peter Charles here from Life Fly Fishing. And one of the biggest challenges that newcomers to this sport face is the ability to cast accurately. We see a fish rise over there. We want to get the cast to the right spot, just above where we saw the rise. And the fly goes who knows where. They also can hook themselves, you know, stick a fly in the back of their jacket or worse, in an ear. So you have all these potential problems and they often have a single cause. And that's the inability to track properly. And, you know, a lot of people, we've talked about the idea of being able to track so that you don't cast in an arc, you cast in a straight line. But it goes not only horizontally, but vertically too. We don't want a cast that swings around in a circle like this. The line follows the path of the rod tip. So if your rod tip curves, the line will curve and it will just go over somewhere over there and not where you want it to go. So let's look at some footage on what's involved in making a track straight. Now when we talk about making a rod tip go in a straight line, it's not just this way or that way, it's both. You want horizontal and vertical straight lines and that's called tracking. So I want my rod tip to travel in a straight line this way as well. I don't want a curving arcing rod going like this because that will put a curve into our line. We don't have a chance of getting a, a, an accurate cast. So you want to track straight. So when I'm casting like this, I'm moving my rod tip in a straight line, both fore and aft and vertically as well. And that gives us accuracy and power and smoothness. Okay, you see the biggest thing about uh, tracking is to ensure that you are aware of the tracking issue, that you know that you have to go straight this way and that way. And the easiest way to achieve that is to have somebody uh, watch for you. You know, if both of you are learning casting at the same time, that's great. So somebody can stand behind you and watch your rod tip and make sure it's going in a straight line and it's not curving around the back of your head, curving this way, or it's not arcing this way. Sometimes it's hard for us to notice when we're doing it our set by ourselves, but if you have somebody watch, it can be the key to getting your rod tip to move in a straight line in both planes. So give that a try. Cheers.